Now, I'm not necessarily gonna hold you. You're probably wondering, why are we talking about this? And much less, didn't we do one of these before? You're right, we did. Mainly on one person, which was Hazker. Which, fun fact, in the future of this video, there will be a part where we talk about Hazker. But when it comes down to things though, I just felt like talking about it. Mainly because there's some really wild mods that's out there. And also, there is just a lot of fine ass characters in Genshin, to be perfectly honest with you. So... There you go. Now obviously, or maybe not obviously, if you paid attention to the modding scene of Gitchen for any amount of time, modding can equal your account getting banned, obviously. It, well, at least if you're caught doing so, especially like right in the middle of, you know, versus security watching surveillance patrol like their chef reuse or something like that. But anyway, when it comes down to the modding scene, there is a lot more mods than I thought they were. And obviously, there is certain mods that I can't show because, you know, it's it's just, just a lot to censor. So I'll just go ahead and get one of them out the way, which is any lolly mod. There is an existing out there. You can definitely see a naked Klee, Chi Chi, doesn't necessarily matter. Here you go, naked Nahida. Don't she look scrumptious to F. But when it comes down to things though, yeah, there is a lot of mods and not every single mod against you in the NSW. Like, look at this Twilight Lumine mod. This shit look nice. And also I'll be posting the actual pictures of where you know who created the mod on twitter because you know i don't want to necessarily do all that work on this damn video but when it comes down to things though i'll, I'll post it on there later when it comes down to it and it's not gonna be every mod it's just gonna be a few that i thought was really cool and interesting like there is obviously simple mods like the underwater censorship that's there that you can remove thanks to it because yeah shouldn't necessarily be underwater censorship. Like, again, Hoyaverse, I'm going that way. I have to swim that way. The camera is literally focused that way. I'm sorry if I looked up Barbara's ass. Her cheeks are just in the way, and I have to see in the way of where I'm going. There's also a quote-unquote fat mod, <laughs> because why not, of a lot of the characters, and I ain't gonna necessarily hold you. Ka-ching and Noelle? they kind of they kind of hitting the standard for me they kind of hitting the standard for me i'm not super you know uh, like completely for super heavy people if that's you then that's fine but for me that's not the case but i will definitely take you know noel and chain because why not also noel's about damn near one of the finer characters in this game that i feel like people sleep on a lot no surprise that there is also a thick amber mod which why not? I mean, granted, that was the reason why I got into Genshin even in the first place. I dedicated a whole video to it, talking about Amber's fat cheeks, so there you go, right? If you need something like that, it's not necessarily bad. Also, there's a before and after of the image, so this is before, this is after. Nice to see it, honestly, so that's fun. Also, there's like a spilling out mod. What that means is basically the top is about to be spilling out like it's crazy, so yeah. That's fine. Just a nice little mean here. So that's pretty damn good. When I first saw it, I was like, holy shit. Why does this exist? Also, hot damn, I'm glad it exists. Then you also have one of the most legendary parts of this damn spilling out mod. At least one of the characters I've seen, which is Navia. And I'm not going to hold you. If I saw Navia looking like this, you finna call me the president of Spina de Rizula because there ain't no way I'm passing this up. There ain't no way. I already like Navia already right she's like one of the characters that actually is like a righteous character but has a reason to be considering how much shit she been through so i feel that for navia honestly more so than a lot of other characters so when it comes down to things you know if navia want to be about damn near about to bust out of her own clothes i'm here for it so definitely gotta get some of that navia spiciness there's also lynette too right and i feel like lynette is also like someone that don't get a lot of art which is annoying as shit but still nonetheless i like me some of that some of that you know lynette cheeks the the, the, the damn the lynette the lynette booba if you will right lynette is definitely some of that i will also say is pretty damn good i like my kudere characters and she's a cat wouldn't be the first one. Would not be the first one. Anyway, and obviously you got your boring, you know, but equally good, just straight up regular proportion nude mod. Like it's not anything surprising, which I won't focus too much time on. Let's just find, because I was just trying to find like the sexier ones or the crazier ones, honestly. So there you go, Shang Ling, which honestly, would you clap Shang Ling? Because I would, honestly. Like, yeah, she gonna make you eat like weird slime shit and you know make weird food out of stuff that you probably don't think is edible but at the very same time she's feeding you 
and, and she's feeding you in a different other way too so i mean you you got options my boy you have options there's also some fun shit here like thick chiori this girl ain't even out yet and you made a thick version of her for one moment of where she's in the fontaine mission that you can't even play again that which the mission is done you can't even have a thick chiori in your game now because guess what she doesn't exist right now because the whole event is done with right so when it comes down to things so it's just like what was what was good what what is actually good when it comes to it you know then you get into some more wild and ones like bath towel miko and really all the characters can get the bath towel treatment which is nice i can only show this one because <laughs> no i'm not trying to show everything else because deaf but that's literally how it is then you also have obviously hazaker and hazaker never fails with the bottom heavy mods right especially this one of like nilo because nilo is i feel like is a character that should be classed on the daily that i feel like a lot of people will pass up for no reason and then you also have chevrius which <sighs> just this is this is just peak i'm not gonna hold you this this is absolutely peak i don't have chevrius which i'm pissed off about that but still nonetheless this is this is qualified peakness right here this is absolute peakness right here you're talking about you don't want chevrius you don't want to basically get handcuffed while she just stomping her whole ass right on top of your freaking clavicle that's a lie. That's a lie, and I know you're lying. I know you're lying. You don't think I can see through the damn TV? Put the damn chips down. Anyway, point is, yes, Chevrolet's Hazaker never fails. Anyway, you also have Thick Noel and Bottom Heavy Noel, right? Pretty damn good, you know. Obviously, it's pretty much. I feel like Bottom Heavy is like a standard at this point. Like, if you have a mod of a character, there has to be like a bottom ass heavy version of them. I feel like that's the standard. Which again, Noel being one of the top people with the best asses in the game i'm not gonna hold you is again someone i feel like is completely underrated and people wouldn't possibly want to clap which i feel like that should be a lie noel is fine as hell the hell you mean you don't want to clap like you had navia and noel together that's raps it is what it is it is literally raps and lastly you also have the starbucks nude mod why is there a starbucks new mod i don't know but i'm here for it gene out here spilling across the damn you know thing that she has like she can't wear the apron properly because her boobs are too damn big right and i can't show that one but i can at least show you mona and whoever is beside her that because they look pretty damn nice i didn't necessarily think i needed a starbucks new mod for this game but it's pretty damn solid and that's just only like the ones i did find right because there's plenty of other nude mods that's for genshin that is out there for example i can't show you any of these but there is definitely more lolly mods obviously there is a whole mod where you have i think lamine like bound up on some bdsm type nonsense you also have a whole mod of just characters walking around like normal but with them is strapped like a whole different character and they're just having smashing sessions while you're playing the game normally so they're just like let's say you're carrying somebody missionary style but you're just walking and fighting characters and stuff normally that's a weird thing but it's it's there you also have one new mod where there's like a uh npc and monster that's getting clapped by ether just you just walk by them they just get in and in for some reason and obviously there's like plenty of other things that's in existence of like the new bots and stuff like that but the point is get shit has an abundance of them obviously again you don't want to necessarily you know put it out in the open for your account because it will get suspended and for the record i'm not using any pc account for myself i'm just finding images online and i play on ps5 so i can't necessarily mock my shit but when it comes down to things though yeah, there's a lot of them. And it, it honestly, again, new mods in general are honestly like the small part of the modding side of things, right? There's plenty of other mods that exist out there that goes dummy and go crazy when it comes down to it, right? But definitely new mods is there, but there's obviously like other crazier, really good mods like the Twilight Lamine mod. Yeah, there's definitely other mods that's out there, but this is just the side that I just wanted to basically focus on. That's essentially all I really want to cover for this one. Was this just me horny posting? Kinda. But at the very end, did you enjoy it? Hopefully you did. And again, I'll be posting the pictures of the creators that has made certain mods on Twitter, which you can find in the description, which I don't know how nobody really looked in the description to see that i have a twitter again because i do 
it, it's it's not that hard here, here you go it's not that hard but that's essentially all i have for you for this one so hopefully you did enjoy if you did be sure to like subscribe hit the notification on the way out also follow me on the socials and if you like to donate to the channel cash chef and ko-fi is available as well please do your boy needs it and until then it's your boy jay signing off have a blessed day